Uh, and I wrote, published a book early this year, uh, which I will do a shameless plug for, uh, from Princeton University Press on the locusts and the bees. And basically saying that the world is a constant struggle between the bees, who are the people who create useful things, ideas, value, and the locusts, who are the predators, who you find in governments, you find in finance, you find in business, you find in every walk of life. And much of human history is a struggle between them. And during some periods, the locusts win, uh, win big time, and other periods, the bees win big time. But it's, it's always a struggle, and I imagine everyone here is a, a bee, or a bee peeper, uh, but we should never be naive about what we're up against, which is a default, usually to destroy and take value. The other um, problem, I think, is that although in some ways everyone loves innovation, they love reading you know, magazine articles about great new texts or whatever, in another sense, and it's really important to remember this, everyone hates innovation. Because real innovation threatens people's jobs, their livelihoods, their identity, everything about them. It is nearly always disruptive, and has been for 200 years, perhaps for 2,000 years. And that's why you get this paradox uh, in all of the world, endless magazines, conferences, and so on, about innovation, but in reality, most institutions with power resisting it. And they resist it precisely because it is threatening. So, um, and it's often only when necessity forces innovation that it starts happening for real. Now, 